My name is Mona Baltazar. I am a hairdresser. I have been a hairdresser for 15 years. My favorite thing about hairdressing is being able to create, and I enjoy knitting. The last two years, I have been focusing more on doing curly hair. What I like most about um, doing curly hair is that I get to touch all these textures. I get to be able to see different curl patterns, being able to just touch and feel them and be able to just build something and cut it, really. <laughs> I get wavy, curly, coily hair, kinkier hair. I get all the texture and I'm fortunate enough that I, I am at this point where Almost every hour and every day that I am at the salon, it is mostly curly hair. It just takes more time and a little bit more patience to do curly hair, but at the end of the day, it's still hair. I want to know, so how's your hair? Where has it been? My clients are so willing to share all that with me and be able to, to help me grow and help me actually understand it. So I'm fortunate to, to be able to have that. Each one has their own story, but each one has a similar story. And it's actually really powerful because it stems a lot from their culture. It stems a lot from just history. And, and I learned all that and I can feel that. And it's really emotional. And constant building and creating for me is important. And being able to use my hands is one thing that keeps me inspired. The connection between knitting and curly hair is that they have similar texture. You can get all different texture in the yarn and you can get all different texture in curly hair. It's almost kind of the texture that I see in curly hair. And when you knit, it's that the texture and the volume that you can actually manipulate. It's almost kind of similar in some sense in the touch of the yarn and feel of the hair. It's like another fabric, it's a thread. It's like a strand. Whatever color you are, I feel like, or whatever culture you come from, there's always someone with curly hair.